Porsche 911 is undoubtedly one of the most iconic and recognizable high-performance sports cars in the world. The 911 Carrera S boasts a twin-turbocharged 3-liter flat-six engine, delivering 443 horsepower, accelerating from 0 to 60 in just 3.5 seconds, and reaching a top speed of 191 miles per hour. Let's look at styling. Starting from the front, it maintains that iconic 911 front end shape, which is a classic Porsche signature. The hood slopes down gracefully and the lines on it flow smoothly towards the windshield. It's a subtle yet elegant design. And what I really appreciate is how sharp those lines look. It immediately gives you the sense of a high performance sports car. And personally, I'm a huge fan of it. Right in the center, we have the Porsche logo, exuding an elegant and exquisite presence. Dominating the front are these substantial circular LED headlights that exude a distinct coolness. You'll notice four outer beams surrounding a prominent central beam with the Porsche logo proudly positioned within it. A delightful and thoughtful touch. If we take a look down here, you'll spot some LED fog lights positioned right above these large vents, which serve the important function of cooling the radiators. There are parking sensors all around, and there's even a rear camera that provides a complete 360-degree view of the vehicle. Take a glance at the lower side, and you'll notice some sleek black trim, accentuated with a touch of shark blue on the front splitter. As we move towards the side profile, you'll find your turn signals right here. In profile, you can really appreciate how far that front end extends, giving it that classic, timeless appearance. The attention to detail in this car is remarkable, and the color combination works incredibly well for me. The black window trim stands out beautifully against the shark blue paint. The entire roofline gently slopes toward the rear of the car, creating a sleek silhouette. Notice the fuel cap positioned on the front fender, adding to the design's flair. But the standout feature here has to be these enormous rear fenders. You can clearly see how much wider they are compared to the front, and it's undeniably cool. Moving along, we have large front windows that become smaller as you move to the rear. And don't miss our side mirrors, perfectly positioned for function and style. Plus, these body-colored door handles are seamlessly integrated into the bodywork, adding to the overall clean and sleek look. On the wheels, we have large 20-inch front wheels and 21-inch rear wheels. The base 911 Carrera is priced at $114,400, while the Carrera S is priced at $131,300. As we move towards the back of the car, you'll notice the brake light positioned on top of the engine cover. The layout here is quite intriguing, and I'm excited to show you what's under this cover. Let's open it up and take a peek at the engine. This little flap reveals a stylish metal emblem with the number 3.0, representing the twin turbocharged 3-liter flat-six engine. You can also see a couple of cooling fans in action, working to keep things running smoothly, both for the oil and the cooling system. Let's talk about this impressive power-operated rear wing. It's designed to pop up with just a touch of a button, and it also automatically deploys at high speeds to enhance downforce, adding to the car's performance. Take a look at the massive LED rear taillight that stretches across the entire rear section, seamlessly connecting the fenders. I really appreciate how it's integrated into the bodywork, with the Porsche logo and 911 prominently displayed, reminding you of the car you're driving. And don't miss the subtle but stylish shark blue accents throughout, including the lower diffusers, which are finished in the same striking paint. You'll also spot parking sensors for added convenience and functionality, along with two real black exhaust outlets. All these elements come together to give the rear end of the 992 a truly modern and captivating feel. Let's take a look inside. As you approach the car with the key in your pocket, you'll notice that the door handles automatically extend for your convenience. To get in, simply place your hand underneath the handle, and it's as easy as that. Once you're inside, you'll find a stylish all-black leather interior with eye-catching blue seat belts and some sleek black accents scattered throughout. Let's start by taking a closer look at the door panel, which is finished in black. Here, we've got a cool dark gray trim piece. It gracefully runs into the release handle, the seat profiles with the lock and unlock buttons, the window controls, and the mirror adjustment buttons. You'll also find some soft leather for added comfort, a sturdy grab handle, and a bit of storage space for water bottles. 
Looking at the door sills, you'll notice the 911 Carrera S name beautifully etched into them. On the left side of the seat, you have a set of power controls for adjusting your seat position, as well as buttons for opening the front trunk and rear trunk. Speaking of the seats, they're incredibly inviting. They're wrapped in plush, soft black leather with perforated leather in the center sections and snug bolsters. These bolsters extend all the way up towards the headrest, and what's really neat is that they have built-in cooling features. This means they can blow cool air on your back and legs, keeping you comfortably cool during your drive. Inside the new 911 Carrera S, the interior is futuristic and elegant. To start the engine, simply press the brake pedal and activate the ignition using the start-stop switch located on the far left. Now, let's dive into the details of the steering wheel. It's not just a steering wheel, it's a control hub. On the left side, you'll find buttons to adjust audio volume and track selection, allowing the driver to stay focused without taking their hands off the wheel. On the right side, there are controls for selecting different driving modes, along with a scroll button and back and next buttons for easy navigation. In the center of the steering wheel, there's a stylish Porsche logo. Moving on to the controls around the steering wheel, on the left side, we've got the turn signal stock, and just below that, you'll find the cruise control functions. On the right side, you'll see the windshield wiper stock. Moving a bit to the left, you'll find the headlight controls and the start-stop button making essential functions conveniently accessible. As mentioned earlier, the right side of the steering wheel has a scroll button to scroll through various vehicle settings on the instrument cluster. Now, let's talk about that instrument cluster. It's a captivating curved 12.3-inch display that houses not just one, but four digital screens, all wrapped around a central tachometer. You have the flexibility to switch it to full screen mode or full map mode, which displays the central tachometer alongside essential information. This versatile cluster provides the driver with valuable details, navigation information, driving data, and access to different drive modes. Speaking of driving modes, you've got options like wet, normal, sports, sports plus, and individual, enabling you to customize your driving experience to suit your preferences. The Carrera S comes with this Sport Chrono package, enabling an ultra-sporty tuning of the chassis, engine, and transmission, allowing you to adapt your Porsche to the exact way you want to drive it. Let's look at the main screen. It's a spacious 10.9-inch touchscreen, and it comes fully equipped with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. This means you can easily enjoy your favorite music, tune in to radio stations, and explore various entertainment options. But the main screen is not just about fun, it's highly functional too. You can access navigation features, make phone calls, check out maps, and plan your destinations right from the screen. It's your hub for adjusting drive settings, utilizing driver assist features, managing trip settings, and even customizing your comfort preferences. Beneath the screen, you'll find some nifty toggles. For quick access to your wet mode, sport mode, hazards, traction control, and suspension settings, these make it incredibly simple to fine-tune your driving experience on the fly. Just below that, we have two air vents, and right beside them are the climate controls, complete with toggles for adjusting fan speed and dual-zone temperature settings. Moving to the left, you'll notice some audio controls and defrost options. While on the right side of the screen, there's a multifunctional wheel that lets you control and interact with the screen. This means you have options beyond just using the touchscreen, making it super convenient. The shifter itself has a new design, shorter and stubbier but surprisingly functional. Nearby, you'll find some sleek black piano accents, heated seats, and a convenient cup holder. And if you lift this armrest right here, it reveals a bit of storage space with USB and SD card slots, making it perfect for charging your phone or keeping your wallet. Not to forget, we have the traditional glove box over here, offering a decent amount of storage space. The passenger also has his or her own cup holder, which is cool. This car comes with the optional panoramic roof that lets you get a beautiful sky view while traveling.
Beyond the 125 liters of space up front, the Carrera S offers a rear seat delete option, giving you an extra 9 cubic feet of storage right behind the seats. This means you've got ample room for a weekend getaway. And if you prefer having rear seats, you can always put them back in. That's it for today guys, we will be back again for more car focus, in the meantime, subscribe, goodbye.